I always had the impression that Royce was trying to do some good. He was most of all an exemplary human being. He's just quite a remarkable man. I've learned a lot from him. <laughs> he is very charming. He's very smart and a great leader. He was right out of central casting for the chairman of the board. If I were to cast someone to play Roy Steiner, it'd be Cary Grant. Cary Grant. Oh, Cary Grant, absolutely. Royce is a guy who went to war, and that formed his character. World War II, Iwo Jima. He received the Distinguished Flying Cross with oak leaf clusters. We met at work, and we had a wonderful, exciting time at AMI. During Royce's administration as CEO, the company grew from over $100 million in annual revenues to over $4 billion. When he retired, we got married. Six months of sitting around the house wondering what to do with myself. I said, this isn't going to work. I'm going to get involved in the community. Royce was very engaged in the life and the substance of the Los Angeles Philharmonic and of the Hollywood Bowl. Royce was very instrumental in UCLA and the UCLA hospital system is now ranked the number three in the nation. God, I mean, I can't believe that this is here compared to what we had before. And so there's been this great addition to the community of Los Angeles. Royce had a genius for empowerment. Not all leaders have it. Many are, consider themselves strong and have a definitive view of how they want to see things done. Royce empowered his executives by encouraging them to use their own unique and individual styles. Royce, I was about to say, Royce, I love you. Now, don't you misinterpret that, Royce. You're not that good looking or special. So I do love what you stand for. I love what you have done. Uh, you're a great human being. Harvard University, AMI, UCLA, the Hollywood Bowl. All of the institutions that he's been on the board of have benefited from the wisdom of Royce. Royce, for all the things that you've done and all I've learned, I want to thank you very much for all of that. From all of Los Angeles. Thank you, Royce. Thank you, Royce. Honey, you know, every time you take me to lunch, I always thank you for lunch. Hey, Jennifer, I want to thank you for 38 years of wonderful life together and for being the most loyal, supportive, and loving person that I could conceive of. <laughs>